Did you see the Cannon Beach Elks this weekend? No? Well, what were you up to? That's a question I asked today on social. I had an extra long weekend hosting my three best friends from Minnesota. We've been friends for a decade, and while we do live many, many miles apart, we never seem to skip a beat. And they had a blast in Portland and in Oregon wine country. How can you not, right? And speaking of Oregon wine, No got a taste this weekend. He was at Pudding River, River Winery in Salem. Looks like they had a great time and had great weather for it. A busy weekend of family celebrations for Ryan. He saw his nephew graduate from Kelso High School. You can see the cap and gown pictured there. And then it was off to his son's final soccer game of the spring season. Greg knows a thing or two about family. He also spent the weekend celebrating milestones. Just look at that lovely photo. And a big congratulations to all the graduates out there. And from milestones to new adventures, check out Rob and his son Ty getting some high flying thrills this weekend at iFly. That is so cool. I've always wanted to go skydiving and I've also always wanted to do this. It seems so cool. Well, it was a big weekend in Portland, as we mentioned before, for the Rose Festival. Huynh was in the Grand Floral Parade, marching with the Vietnamese community. Here she is with her two daughters. This is just such a beautiful photo. Hope you had fun in the parade, ladies. And did you catch the Dragon Boat races? Yeah, 46 teams took part in the tradition on the Willamette River this weekend. Angie shared this photo of one of the medal-winning teams for Daimler Trucks. So cool, great shot. And possibly even more intimidating than a dragon, it's Dexter. Just kidding, look at this sweet happy boy. He is not intimidating at all. I just wanna give him sweet kisses. Tiffany's been busy dog watching and house sitting, but she finally had some quality time with her own pooch here. Well, oh, shit, you good boy. Well, you can share your photos and stories of good stuff happening in your community. Do it by texting us at that number right there, 503-226-5088. You can also email me at thegoodstuff at kgw.com.